Hello everyone and welcome to your channel Techwine. In this video, I will provide you the shortest solution for this lab. And if you are able to complete this lab by the method I provide, please consider subscribing. Once you get these credentials, simply open the cloud console in the incognito window and sign in with the username and password provided in the lab. Go back, copy the password. Now we have to create a bucket. So from this left panel, go to this cloud storage, then open the buckets. Click on create. And for the name of bucket, you can use your GCP ID. Simply copy it. Then click on create. Confirm. And when your bucket is created, we have to upload a file to it. Now there are two methods to download this file. First one is copy the GCP ID. Go to my telegram channel and simply search for the ID. And you will get this file. You can download it from here. And the second method you can download this file is to go to the description of this video. You will find a GitHub link. Simply click on this icon. And this file will be downloaded on your local system. Simply save it. Go back to the bucket. Click upload files. Then simply upload the file that you downloaded. And once your file is uploaded, you can go back to the lab and check the progress for the fourth task. We have created the bucket. And also we have uploaded the CSV file. Now we have to create a SQL instance. So copy the name of the instance. Go back to the cloud platform. Search for SQL. Open this. Now click on create instance. Then choose my SQL. Paste the instance ID. Then for the password, click on generate. And make sure to save this password in a new tab because we will need this password later in the lab so make sure you save it scroll down for the database version you have to choose mysql 5.7 again scroll down for the region go back to the lab now choose the region according to your lab and make sure this multiple zones is selected then click on create instance now you have to simply wait for 4 to 5 minutes till your instance is created. Just wait for a few seconds. And you will see this type of icon that instance is being created. Now you have to simply wait for 4 to 5 minutes till the instance is created. Ok now our instance is created. Then simply open the cloud shell. This instance at least took 7 to 8 minutes to get created. So simply wait for that time. Go back to the lab. Now check your progress for the fifth task. Scroll down a bit. Then you will see this command copy it and run it in the cloud shell. Authorize. Again you have to wait for 2 to 3 minutes. After that we have to enter a password. For the password, if you remember, we saved the password in a new tab. Simply copy it. Then paste it by pressing Ctrl plus V. And this password will not be visible to you. So simply press Ctrl plus V. Then hit enter. And again go back to the lab. Copy the last command. Simply run it. And you can go back and check the progress for this task also. Congrats, you have successfully completed this lab. If this video solution was helpful, please consider subscribing. See you all in the next video. Till then, stay safe, stay healthy.